Today we'll be transforming Transformers War for Cybertron Siege Netflix Sparkless Spot. Probably got that wrong. But this is the way he is over the packaging. And it's on the ball joint. Go around 360. Arms. Rotate around. Not that far. Move the shoulder pads if you want. Rotation. 90 degrees of bend and hand rotation. Waist rotation. Thigh swivel. Over 90 degrees of uh, over 90 degrees of bend at the knee. Ankle tilt. You can position the toes however you want. And heel spur. Now the package in here is his light bar separator. He comes with a light bar because I believe this is a repaint of the prowl mold mold. He is a police car. Also comes with two guns. Can hold one in each hand. Can also peg it in up here. As well as pick them together. Let's see, you look like a zombie. Hmm. zombie pose now down the transformation unpeg his waist I guess bring the hood the center of the hood of the car up and push in his waist rotate the wheels so that they're facing up bring his arms out we'll come back to that and we'll, oh, you can rotate the waist and then move on to the feet collapse the heel spurs if they have it already Bring down his feet and peg him together. No. So, and then we're going to accordion on the back of the car. BTA problems again. And then accordion in the front of the car. Next up to pedal together, bring in the doors. Nice 
nice and sturdy. Bring, um, almost there. Bring around the arms. And then they'll just tuck in in this empty space. I believe I have the light bar on backwards. Yeah, that's better. This one, the roll is okay. The passenger side. Are there passengers on Cybertron? If this was if this was an Earth mode car, the passenger side back wheel has a hard time rotating on mine. The driver's side gives me some problems too. Still rolls. And vehicle mode Unpack the guns and put them in this spot here. And that is sparkless spot. 